Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. And in this video, you're gonna talk about how to show your venue dashboard or include venue dashboard when you are designing a page with Elementor. Okay, so if you don't know what Elementor is, we have a lot of tutorials in this website how to include certain uh, WP Event Manager elements inside Elementor and use them with your design. We're gonna follow the same tutorial over here, like the same type, and I'm gonna show you how you can do the same for the venue dashboard. Okay. So to get started, we're gonna create a new page. And in this page, you can name this page or change your default template, then publish it. Or you can click on this edit with Elementor button that will load the Elementor designer window. And over here, uh, you can come to WP Event Manager uh, like section over here, or you can search for uh, event venue or like you can search for venue dashboard or you can like choose it from here as well so that's the uh, element we need you can drop it over here and that will load up the venue dashboard for you inside the elementor window okay so the benefits of using elementor to design a page is you can get like a beautiful layout created by elementor using this drag and drop builder and you don't have to use any short code as well Okay, so the venue dashboard element, it lets you configure only one parameter. So that's post per page that controls how many like uh, venue you want to show in this dashboard by default. Okay, so it's currently set to 10. If I set it to three, you'll see like it will show only three venues over here by default. And then you have the pagination to play with, right? So that's the configurability options for venue dashboard when you're using event uh, like Elementor. And uh, I'm gonna show you a bit of example about how to uh, like customize this page uh, using Elementor as well, okay? So you can click settings and change this to full width so that uh, get rid of the sidebar and the uh, page title section. Now you can like uh, create uh, custom elements over here as well. So let's say if you wanna like include a image in the header section, you can do that. Uh, so let's drop it there and you can change this to, let's say this one. So what this lets you uh, like create a beautiful design with Elementor, okay? So now over here you can include like your own banner or one call out section, like uh, subscribe to new shelter section over here, right? So that's how it works actually. It is not a tutorial for uh, like getting started with Elementor design, but uh, what I'm showing you over here is like, let's say you are creating a page with Elementor where you wanna like show the venue dashboard. Uh, you can do that via Elementor as well. WP Event Manager gives you the ability to include that, right? So this being a short video about how to include venue dashboard when you are designing a page with Elementor. So follow this guide if you are a beginner and you are getting started with Elementor, you are designing the page with Elementor and you wanna show the venue dashboard over there. Or if you are a pro like designer already with Elementor, you can use this tutorial as well, all right? So that's pretty much wraps it up for this video. I'm Shara saying goodbye. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.